Diminished Brown standing by with this Monday for a hey, look what is behind you a yeah. big old sun. Oh, uh, how about that? <laughs> <laughs> Monday comes too quick, man. It's what we've been seeing the past over the past several weeks, right? Too much sun, too much hot weather. Mm -hmm. but we have some changes on the way. We're tracking those. How about temperatures tomorrow near 102? By the time we head into your Thursday, temperatures about 92 with an opportunity for some showers and thunderstorms. Quite a difference for us. We are tracking a cold front that will work its way in Wednesday into Thursday, and that will give rain to at least part parts of the area overnight into Thursday, about a 20 to 30 percent chance of showers and thunderstorms. So that will be kind of nice for us. A live view outside over, you'll see Dallas here. We see a veil of high clouds. Temperatures about 99 degrees to near 100. You'll see some triple digits out there, but 97 in Fort Worth, 97 also in McKinney and 99 in Denton. Check out this big temperature difference. Okay, 102 for tomorrow, 101 for Wednesday, 92 for Thursday. That's quite a drop. Some models are even saying the upper 80s. I'm not being that generous just yet, okay? <laughs> we'll check things out as we go through the week. We'll keep temperatures at least near average 95 for your Friday and 97 degrees into your Saturday. Off to school in the morning, we'll see temperatures in the low 80s with a southwest wind about 5 to 10 miles an hour. And as we go through the day, a dry wind force, temperatures rising up to about 93 at 11 and 100 degrees at 3 o'clock in the afternoon. So we have some clouds out there right now partly due to this system down to our south. It looks like a tropical storm over land. I wish we could tap into some of this rain. This is what some of our friends in South Texas dealt with over the past couple of days, but this rain is headed in the wrong direction. It's headed westbound. Well, we do have our opportunity to see some showers and thunderstorms with that cold front I was talking about. The rain chances will go up to about 30% Thursday. Then we'll have another chance and to the second half of the weekend, especially. So here's a look at future cast. This is a look at the long range forecast model as we go into Wednesday morning there as this front drops in. I think best rain chances later in the day overnight into our Thursday morning, most likely. The model wants to keep some wet weather around later on in the afternoon, but I think it's probably picking up on a few more clouds than anything else. Then once we look ahead, we could see with this rain here through at least Friday, maybe a 10 to a quarter of an inch of rain in a few spots. And then with another brush of showers and storms moving in by the second half of the weekend into early next week, that, my friends, will be a good drink of water if we see an inch of rain out of that next system. So here's that first alert seven day forecast. Low 90s for Thursday, 95 for your Friday. Look at the rain chances next week. This is next Sunday, by the way, 30% later in the day, but up to a 50% chance on Monday. And next Tuesday, the models are saying that we could have at least a 60% chance of wet weather. Yeah, by next Tuesday. So something to look forward to.